Hey y'all, welcome back to the workshop. Artisan Pirate here. A few videos back, I mentioned I wanted to take you guys to the local Makerspace Steam Junction. Well, today is the day we're going to head down there. I need some stuff 3D printed on one of their 3D printers. I'm going to get a scroll saw table insert 3D printed because this one does not line up with the table of the scroll saw I use for thick cutting. The one I use mostly on the other scroll saw sits flush on the table and I'm going to put the camera close here in a second so you guys can see it but this one sits flush and this one has kind of a lip when it goes to the main table of the scroll saw but let me move the camera closer and I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about hopefully in a little better detail. Here is a close up of the scroll saw I have set up for thick cutting the table and the table insert that you take out for blade changes. Um, the problem we're going to try to fix with 3D printing is when you're cutting something and you get it through the blade and you get to the lip, see it gets caught. It gets caught on this lip and then while scrolling you have to actually lift it over the lip and then continue on. So we're going to try to correct that with 3D printing. Now we're going to head down to the local Makerspace Steam Junction. I removed both of the scroll saw table inserts to compare them when we 3D print one. So let's head down to the Makerspace. Steam Junction Makerspace is located at 111 Front Street in downtown Burlington. Their hours are Monday through Friday. 1 p.m. to 7 p.m. Saturday 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. and on Sunday they are closed. Come on down and make something today. Here we have a Fusion 3 3D printer. We have a file selected off a of Thingiverse that is supposed to be an exact replica of the little um, table insert for the scroll saw. We have some filament in it and what we're going to do is hit start and see how it works. Here we have the scroll saw table insert. We just removed it off the bed of the 3D printer. An exact replica of the ones that I brought from home. So I think that turned out real good. Steam Junction is also home to a Muse laser cutter capable of several awesome things. Here are a few examples. It can engrave on denim, wood, and I think this is really awesome. This keychain and each of the four sides has a different 
laser engraved detail on it. Really cool. Steam Junction Makerspace is also home to a 24 inch by 18 inch ShopBot desktop model available for use. It can make very amazing things such as this Alamance Makers Guild business card holder complete with gears. Really cool. Here we have the world's largest game of Tetris made by members here at Steam Junction complete with remote control. You just hit a button for the game to start. All designed and made locally here in Burlington, North Carolina. Back in the workshop I have the 3D printed scroll saw table insert. I already have the one table insert back in the scroll saw set up for stack cutting and variable speed cutting. Here is the thick cutting scroll saw so let's see how the new 3D printed scroll saw table insert fits. Wow! That is a very nice fit slides right down in there and you don't have that lip like you had with this one. I don't know why this one is not as thick and does not sit flush with the table. I don't know if that was just a design flaw at the time but anyway here is the new one and as you can tell when you go through the blade it's not going to catch on that lip on the back side here. It's nice and smooth. Awesome job. Thank you, Steam Junction Makerspace. Okay, that about wraps up this video. I hope you guys really like that small tour of Steam Junction Makerspace. They have a ton more to offer than what I showed in this little video, so I urge you to go by and check them out at 111 Front Street in historic downtown Burlington. Their hours are Monday through Friday, 1 p.m. to 7 p.m., and Saturday, 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. They host various interest groups, um, maker meetings, and all sorts of things. I'm going to drop a link down in the description to their social media sites and their website and also to the file we use to 3D print this scroll saw table insert. 3D printing is very new to me and I really love to watch the machines just go around and around and build something up just out of little melted plastic. I think that is awesome to sit there and watch. Um, I think this little scroll saw table insert is going to work for what I use on that scroll saw. I don't use that scroll saw much just for thick cutting and sometimes for ripping down smaller stock to use on the other scroll saw when I stack cut. But that is all for this video. Please continue to like and share my videos. If you have it, please click that subscribe button. Should be a Jolly Roger floating around down here somewhere. Take care, and as always, God bless.